does um, martial arts, been around hundreds and hundreds of years. Um, it's also an Olympic sport, very, very popular sport in Great Britain. And on a judo match, you, you fight your opponent, and what you've got to do is you've got to try and throw your opponent on his back, hold them down, strangle them or arm lock them to get them to submit. Anybody can take part in judo. Children, we've got children as young as six, and we have uh, one of the oldest players we had was about 72 on the mat. The benefits of judo is the you get to keep you get to get really fit in judo. It's a really tough sport in terms of keeping fit. Uh, you can uh, you can go through the grades, attain your black belt over a period of time, meet new people. Okay, gives you gives you a lot of experience of how to defend yourself as well. It is a martial art, but it's also an Olympic sport. The the suit um, is basically a white or a blue suit. Yeah, you get a heavy duty jacket and trousers and a belt. And that's, what's, that's what you need to fight. And the reason being, there's a lot of grappling in judo and they need to be really strong. Five um, common throws in judo that you'll see early on. The first one is Osoto Gary, um, where the person takes a grip on the lapels and takes the person back using their leg. second one is Taya Toshi, which is a hand technique, where they take hold of the person on the lapels again and pull the person forward over their leg that sticks out. third technique, Ipon Sayanagi, which is a shoulder throw, which means launching your partner over your shoulder, hand under the armpit, turn in and straight over the top. Fourth technique, Ogoshi, similar to Ipon Senage, only the arm goes around the waist and you lift your opponent right over your hip. It's a hip technique. Fifth technique, Uchimata, which is quite a spectacular technique. The leg goes right through the partner's legs and takes them right over the top.